it's Brenda from Burns Valley Herbals and Retreat. Welcome to the perfect place for your mind, body, and soul. Hey everyone, it's Brenda giving you a uh, April 2021 update on uh, what's happening in the gardens. Right now this is Valerian. Uh, Valerian will, uh, in a couple weeks, shoot up a tall stalk with a seductive white flower on it. There's Valerian. It's kind of big right now. Right aside of it is Wormwood Artemisia Absinthe. Um, this is very good to uh, make tinctures out of for digestive issues and to rid of worms. Uh, and also, if you do have a distiller, this is the one that you could distill for uh, some absinthe. Uh, right next to it, or across from it, there's some Feverfew, which is wonderful for particular uh, migraine headaches. Uh, you can eat the leaves in a salad or in um, a sandwich. Um, and right up from that is whorehound. Whorehound is wonderful. It's great for uh, making uh, cough drops. So you will uh, really appreciate having whorehound around. Uh, you can also uh, make it into a tea. It is kind of bitter, so you definitely have to sweeten it. Uh, here's some anise hyssop. That gets a beautiful uh, purple flower that bees and butterflies like. And it does smell like anise. Um, it's great to put into uh, smudge sticks. Um, it does have a uh, protection element to it. So uh, I do put it in smudge sticks. Uh, some more feverfew, got lots of that. Here we got some um, purple cone flower. This one is Echinacea augustifolia. So there are Papuria or Augustifolia. This one is Augustifolia. They all look alike. You just have to know what you bought. And Ellen Clamp is coming up. Ellen Clamp is good for a whole lot of things, but uh, also for colds and coughs. And Catmint. Catmint is uh, great for uh, tea for humans that uh, is very relaxing but also as you know kitty cats like it too and we have uh, marjoram uh, it's a spice um, and right next to that is some cilantro coming up and cilantro is a very wonderful addition to salads and sandwiches uh, use it in cooking because it is a very powerful herb that will help release uh, uh, heavy metals from your body. And one more will like go down and well here's some mint while we walk by. There's some beautiful luscious looking mint which is great for teas. And this is meadowsweet. Meadowsweet We'll get really close. We'll end up getting tall stalks on it. As you can see, there's some uh, brown stalks here yet. And then it gets real pretty flowers on the top. Meadowsweet is something that uh, used to be used more heavily uh, before uh, aspirin became popular. So a uh, couple things coming up in the garden here, Burns Valley Herbals and Retreat. Hope to see you up here sometime this year and uh, do go to our website and check out the different um, retreats that we do offer uh, regularly and that's at uh, BurnsValleyHerbalsAndRetreat.com Like and subscribe. Have a super day. Bye.